Hello there folks, welcome to Jeb Lean's Cookings. What we're going to cook is something I get asked to do all the time. See, whenever I come home to my husband and um, I try to give him a hug and a kiss, he always goes, cook us a steak, bitch. So that's what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to be cooking a beautiful piece of steak. Let's get into it. All right, now first things first, make sure your pan is clean, okay? Because if it's not clean, we're going to have a bit of an issue, okay? Make sure your pan's clean. And people are going to be like, why would I want to cook a steak? on my pan if I got a fucking barbecue. Well, let me ask you this. Why are you fucking watching this? If you want to cook a steak on the barbecue, go right ahead. You think I give a shit? I kind of do actually, but yeah. Let's make sure we get one last wipe because I do see some antibacterial germies in here, okay? So I'll teach you how to do these, all right? Holy shit. All right, now we get these buggers four thingies, right, we get that, you know, proper shit, you know, back and forth, and really working it, if you don't work enough, you won't get strong enough, and if you don't get strong enough, you're not going to cook enough, and if you don't cook enough, you won't eat enough, so if you don't eat enough, you're not going to get strong enough, that's like a four times water cycle, mate, see, cycles, that's how we do them in circle, radius, Rim jobs, you know? Fuck. See that? That was gonna be on your steak. You want this crap on your steak? Do you? We're not gonna decompose our shit and piss, aren't we? Septic systems, tell you that much. Alright? I'm gonna flog you up. No, you're lucky then. Put there on the pan. Now, the thing is. Right, so go on to our almighty fridge. We get some good steaks. All right, now this is from looks like this is from a cow. So we'll get that done. All right. The thing you need to do is you you listen to me. Alright, get her up there. Get your plate, alright? Alright, now we get our four paper towel system. Give it a good old. Cool. <laughs> you don't want to use this knife. Because we'll need it later. Alright? Don't use this knife. Otherwise, this knife will go up the chuff. Alright? Good. But we're gonna cut the potatoes with that knife. Do you want raw steak on your chippies? Alright, now, so put these fucking. Um, yeah, um, okay, just before I go on, there is coarse language in this. And if you don't like it, piss off. Oh, get fucked! Okay? I've got ya. Ah! Okay, looks like we're gonna have to get this shit open. Fucking wall up there, mate. Oh, sorry. Sorry to the neighbours if they've been hearing too much noise. Okay. Just gotta know that I'm putting up some acoustic phone up there soon. So. Okay. Now, once we get these open, there's gonna be blood everywhere. It's a cow. There's supposed to be blood. It's kind of sick if you think about it. That's why I don't drink dairy. I think blood, blood, blood 
is is enough. But when you milk the animal, just think about it. All right. So we get your knife down there, and look at that. I am already covered in shit. Okay. Now, ugh, that just felt like I fingered a dead girl's prune. This is just sensational. Oh, it's actually two pieces. Come on. If, it, if I'm going to portion my steaks, why did I just, why did, did, did I just wash my hands? Here's where I need your help. If you don't want to see the boring parts, you have the opportunity to cut the video to where it's important. So, what you do? Get, get your imaginary, uh, imaginary knife out. And we'll go, we'll cut the video to where it's important. Okay. So here we go. Help me out. One, two, three. Alright guys, we're going to leave the steak for around 10 minutes. But once I do this, I want to show you how magical I am. I can go from here to my guitar and in three goes. Ready? One, two, three. Everybody flaps Everybody green Down to your mother And then you wrap around Hands on your dick, rub it up and down We've had a wink We've had a wink Everybody flaps, everybody creams, bucket on your mother, and use a wrap around, hands on your dick, rub it up and down, we've had a wank, we've had a wank. I'll teleport from here again. Actually, hold on. How the fuck did I end up here? Open your tays. Alright. Now I'll use this knife. No, 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 no. I can put a knife in my mouth, you, you know that? So, a good serving for potatoes. I'll tell you what. Fresh. Every living thing eats another living thing. So, don't pull me with that vegan shit. Oh, we're. We only, why would you wanna, why would you wanna kill an animal and like, that's just sad. Well, I come back with, why would you wanna kill a plant? It's the same thing.
literally steak and potatoes is a living thing they both come from the womb or from the ground all right get that straight in your head water we're 70 percent of water well for me i'm more like 70 75 percent of pepsi max you know what i'm saying Fuck. okay this one is not bruised Good thinking. All right. Now, a good serving of per potatoes is two, two potatoes per per person. That's a good, 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 good amount. All right. Shut the fuck up before I get my fucking grandmother on here. Before I fucking fucking ask this fucking. What was that? All right. The steak's going up high. We'll leave the steak to you know settle, settle, pedal, eh? And we might even chuck this on the heat too. Now potatoes, probably mid. Now cut them like you normally do. Start on the side. And once you get to the end, you find it a bit hard to cut. Turn it on the flat side down, and you keep it rolling. Cool. Make it easier. We will do the chip sizes now before the other. Make it life a lot, lot more easier. That's my pen going off there. Tripping there for a second. Alright, now if you can't see what I'm doing. So yeah. What I've done, I've got the potato, I put it on the side, and I've cut it to whereabouts it binds a bit like on the end. After the end, turn the flat side down, cut it like that. You you got your shapes there, your circles. Cut them into chips that size, or you'll be right. Okay. Um then bolt your uncle. Put them in the heat, we've got some chippy snacks. Okay. Alright, I'm going to do this potato now. So, you want to help me again? Cut to the good part. Three, two, one. Hey, welcome back, guys. Now, you get your tongs. Get your tongs out. Make sure they're on standby. Get the, get the oil around the pan, just like that, okay. And we now lay it away from us. One, two, ready to hear this? That is what you want to fucking hear when you're cooking a steak for a bitch like me. Right, now, focus. <coughs> Try not to mess with it. You can turn it over, say, once or twice. Um, it, is, it is up to you. Now we're going to wash our plate. Beauty. Now, I'm not much of a huge wine drinker. Pretty, pretty bold. I don't really have any wine glasses, but this is a lovely uh, Pinot, Pinot Noir uh, from a very specific um, uh, vineyard company that Jad Lean supports. It's a lovely wine, honestly. It's beautiful. So 
I guess. Get our grey box out. Alright, I reckon our steak can go for a turn now. She's just looking okay. I can remember that, man. Eh? Alright, and we lift her up again. Pop the oilies on. Same thing, different story. Not a big one, very small cut in the centre. Okay, with the grey box, we get our jug out. Nicely boiled, ready to go. You can keep it on standby, please, guys. We don't know how thick or thin it's going to get, and we're only working out if we keep testing it, okay? You want to help me out again? Three, two, one. Okay. okay let it rest. All the residue you've got in your pan, put it onto the steak. Okay. Ow, you fucking. As I said before, you're not too thin, not too thick. My father loves it thin. And my brother loves it thick. Father's the papa bear, the brother's the mama bear, and I'm the baby bear. And I love it just right. Says the one who pretends to have long hair with a fucking sweater on. <coughs> Turn off the pot. And when they say handles in, handles in if there's kids here. Is there any kids here? Yes. That's the only. Um, Dude, go home. <laughs> okay. Um, I, I just hate it when you have a girlfriend and all they say is, I only see your back. Like, stop sitting down crying. You know? Okay, let leave that for two minutes. I wanted to say to a huge thank you to our food suppliers. Uh, Tammy Unicus Rogers. Uh, without her, I'd be dead. <laughs> there we have it, guys. Here we have a Jabco shit steak. So when people say to you, cook us a steak, bitch, serve them this. It will make him feel a less, a little bit less, um, what's the fucking word? This will make him very, feel a very much less of an entitled person. Honestly though, I could I cooked it for myself. You know? So I'm gonna eat it. Cheers guys. It's a bit nutty. I'm fucking joke, I didn't do that. Thank you guys to watching Jablin's Cooking and I'd like to say a big thank you to our sponsor Ian Hewitson and Pepsi Makes. What am I doing? Thanks for watching, see you later alligator. Don't forget your toilet paper while I'll have to be masturbation. See you later guys. Fucking take my steak away. Oh, you bitch. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck.